So when, why did you decide to start working on, on your own projects? You were freelancing and I guess you were doing uh, yeah. pretty nice yeah, money. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, yeah, the good, yeah, yeah. The first idea, like I started, I, I already knew that I always wanted to have my own company. That was uh, so I wanted to have a, a dev shop, like a long time ago as well. And uh, I started working with people and having my own clients, and um, that was nice, but also like really hard. You you work like like sixty hours a week, and then and the problem a bit with having clients, a lot of different clients, is like they. They call you for everything, right? Like, hey, can you change uh, this or can you change this picture? So after a while, you have a bunch of clients, but your work is kind of fragmented. You're not uh, doing like the, the nice things, like starting new projects and finish them. And yeah, most of the time, if you have clients, they they still have a lot of small things. So I really didn't like that. So then I was like, uh, the startups were, were really hot, like uh, like this ten years ago already. So I thought like, yeah, let's, let's try that. You know, like that's, that's much nicer to have like uh, your own software, which you can kind of, yeah, get, make a living with. So I, yeah, that was kind of uh, the idea. And then, yeah, I did my first big project and it kind of failed. So I went back to freelancing and now recently, like a couple of years ago, I started doing projects again. So I did a lot of, a lot of small projects. <laughs> Okay. Why, why did you, so you had like some time that you were not doing more projects, you focused, you started doing your projects, then you focus again on, on freelancing and then yeah, yeah, you come back yeah. to projects. So why did you, yeah, exactly. why did yeah. you stop and wait, why did you start again? Yeah, it's, it's most of the time you, you think you have something uh, brilliant and then, or you lose interest or the idea isn't that good and you learn a lot, like, uh, or yeah, it's always. It, I think it's a learning process also to have like good ideas, to to find good ideas and to kind of yeah fail, and then you learn from that. So the next idea is better. 